In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to fix screen tearing if you're using Google Chrome, Chromium, or the Opera browser. Now, I do not have Chromium installed on my computer, but I do have Google Chrome installed on my computer, and I do have uh, the Opera browser installed on my computer. So if you follow along with the steps in this video, if you're using Opera, Google Chrome, or Chromium browser, this should fix the screen tearing on your system if you're using a Linux-based uh, computer. Now, I've got a website that uh, you can refer to if you're having trouble following along the steps in the video. If you found this on YouTube, in the description below you'll see a link to my website that has these steps. So that way you don't have to pause, do what I did, because uh, some of the settings may require you to stop or close your browser reopen it back up and if you're watching YouTube especially if you're watching it in your browser that you're getting the screen tearing you have to come back to the video and that can be annoying so I'll have the link below to follow these steps now if you look above I do I am below on the scroll bar it's because above here I, I did a video on how to fix screen tearing on AMD graphics cards if you look below this is a section just for fixing screen tearing in Google Chrome, Chromium and the Opera browsers now I would demonstrate with Chrome the same thing will work in Chromium, the same steps, but in the Opera browser, when you get to the bottom, I will show you that instead of putting the Chrome flags that you see up here, you're just going to replace the word Chrome with the word Opera, and the same steps apply. Alright, let's get started. This is a three-step procedure on fixing the screen tearing on your uh, browser within your browser. To start with, you got to turn uh, on your browser hardware accelerator. To do that, you've got to go into your Chrome's settings. So I'm going to highlight this command. I'm going to open up a new tab since I am within my Google Chrome browser. And I'm going to paste and go. When I do, if you look on this page, I'm going to go between accessibility and reset. I'm going to go to the section of system. In this section, there's a command that says use hardware acceleration when available. You're going to make sure that is turned on. So I'm going to scroll down, and as you scroll so far, you're going to get into the advanced settings. You hit the drop down arrow, and it allows you to keep scrolling down. And when I see accessories, that tells me I need to slow down. And there it is. Here's my system, and if you look, it says use hardware acceleration when available. Mine within my browser was turned off. I turn this on and you may not have to do steps two and three after you turn it on close your browser reopen it go to YouTube or wherever you're experiencing your screen tearing if you're still experiencing screen tearing then you go on to the next steps your step two and step three so after you've turned this on and you've checked and you're still experiencing screen tearing the next thing you want to do is to turn off or disable your smooth scrolling now you're not going to go in your Chrome settings. This time you're going to go into your Chrome flags. So you select the Chrome colon forward slash forward slash flags forward slash or you don't have to have a forward slash there but I think it still works. It does. Now this time there's going to be a lot here and I've already disabled this and I've got two and three already since I've changed or modified my flag setting it put them at the top. So yours may not look like this at the top. You may have to search for it. So what you do, if you don't see it, and this is what I screenshot before I did it, there's a place where you search for the flag. You're going to search, you can call it, as you can see, I typed in smooth. So you can look for the word smooth, or you can look for the word smooth scrolling by putting it in your flag and hitting the return key or the enter key. And that's, as you can see, it's here. It's going to be on default or off you're going to disable it. So you're going to hit the drop down key and I think mine was at default, yours may be enabled, and you're going to disable it. After you disable it, you're going to restart your Chrome browser and that could fix some of your screen tearing. In my case, it didn't. I still had a little bit. It was no longer as noticeable as it was originally. It got better, but I still had some that aggravated me. To get rid of all of the screen tearing, I did step three and this completely got rid of every bit of the screen tearing on my computer within my Chrome, my Opera, and my and and I would assume it would on Chromium browser since it is very similar to the Google Chrome. Here you're going to turn off in step three, you're going to turn 
on, I'm sorry, or enable where it says override software rendering list. To do that, it's in the same place you were already at. So if you didn't have that tab open, if you've closed and reopened it, you go back and put this in your browser and hit enter and it brings it here. This is where you're going to override your software rendering list. Your override your software rendering list. And if you didn't have that at the top, you just simply search for the word override. So I go in here and I type in override. O V E R R I D E. And as you can see here, there's three overrides, but the one I'm concerned with is the override software rendering list. By uh, normal, I think all three of these were default. I chose enable. You're going to enable this feature. After you enabled it, you're going to close your browser, reopen your browser, and after you've done all three of these, it should completely eliminate your screen tearing in your Google Chrome and Chromium browsers. As I said, if you're using your Opera browser, and I'm not going to go all through these settings, I will give you an example. Uh, it will work identical the same way. The only thing different than Google Chrome and your Opera browser is instead of saying Chrome forward slash forward slash flags, you're going to put Opera forward slash forward slash in your flags, and then you actually do it the same way because Opera is just a branch off of Google Chrome. And as you can see here, I've enabled the override software rendering list, and I've actually uh, disabled the experimental uh, enabled shared array buffer that supports the JavaScript. So you can still do the same commands in Opera. You just have to put the word Opera before your flags instead of the word Chromes. And you can do the same identical steps in step one, two, and three, and that should fix the screen tearing in your Opera browser. So hopefully if you have an AMD graphics card, if you've done the steps that I've done above, and if you have screen tearing in your Google Chrome or your Chromium or your Opera browser, you've done the steps that I have below. Now if you want to test it, the way that you can test it, if you're already on my website, I do have a couple videos that I've embedded from YouTube that allows you to test your video card for screen tearing. I'm not going to click it because if you're experiencing screen te tearing on your screen, it's going to look like mine is t uh, tearing. I read on videos below on some of these where people said you're still experiencing screen tearing and it's because they were. Uh, and I read where p other people commented back where are you experiencing screen tearing and so on and so forth. But I'm not going to keep elaborating on that. These videos are embedded where you can click onto them and then maximize it and look for screen tearing. Now I do have a little warning here that you know if you're affected by flashing lights uh, please be uh, cautious because these do have flashing lights on them that can cause problems with some people so there's a little disclaimer here that there are some flashing lights in these videos but the videos that I'm creating will be embedded here uh, so don't click on these thinking that you're going to get the test these are the test videos and my YouTube videos will be above those Hopefully you've now fixed your screen tearing on your machine and you are using a screen free computer now. Have a great day.